Welcome to the Old Timer Centre. My name is Philip Tarrant. I'm going to be speaking to you about this 2011 Audi Q7. It's done 95,000 kilometres since it was new and it's an update. It's also an S-Line and it's got the 3 litre turbo diesel engine. The update came with these much, much better looking tail lights, LED lights on the front and xenon lights. It's also got the much better looking alloy wheels all round. It's an S-Line, it's got reverse camera, navigation, it's uh, got a good service history to it. It's black with black leather interior. It doesn't have the big panoramic sunroof, which in a lot of ways is a good thing because the, they've got drain holes and things that can get blocked up over time. And as a result, you can get some, some leaking into the cabin, which uh, is not great when you've got so many electricals and computers in a car like this. It's got tinted windows. It's got adjustable rear air conditioning. It's a seven seater. Thing about these Audi Q7s is being a family car and a seven seater, you know, over 95,000 kilometers, they, they can be very well used. If you imagine a family of five, six or seven getting in and out of a car like this for seven years, you can get dents, scrapes, scratches as a family dog, the list goes on. This car really doesn't look like it's been used as a family car. For a black car, it's in immaculate condition on the outside. The interior is also in immaculate condition. The back seats don't even look like they've been sat in. The carpets are also very good, free from stains and things. So if you've been looking for an Audi Q7 in an update series, this is very, very good. You can see the back seat's nice and clean. Normally you get dents in the leather from uh, child seats. And sorry it's a bit dark, but uh, no, if you come and look at it for yourself, it is in beautiful condition. Often the switches scratch and they go white because they're white under the black. But yeah, it's just been, had very little use. I don't know if it's done some freeway driving or if it's just had you know, one person driving it a lot of the time. But it really is in very good condition. So it's got the daytime running lights, Xenon lights, navigation, Bluetooth, S-Line. I guess, you know, some of the options that are available on these, um, really a sunroof, which, as I was talking about, you don't really want. Air suspension, which I can tell you now, you don't really want either. So there is an option to get adjustable suspension where you can raise the car and lower it. And there's a sport setting as well, which is great when it works. But if you need to, you know, change a shock absorber down the track, it can be very, very expensive. It does have an electric boot. And I think represents incredible value for the update series in an S-Line with some good options. If you have any specific questions about the car, please give us a call. We're contact one oh two nine five six nine double nine double nine. We transport cars all over Australia and we have a finance person available if you want to talk about finance. Thanks again for watching. We certainly do look forward to hearing from you.